Well, obviously another serious incident, the seventh in five years here in Argyll on this particular road, although the landslide this time is in a different place to previous ones. We can talk to Kevin Campbell, who's from Bear Scotland, the company which is charged with uh, looking after this road. Kevin, what is the problem? The problem is there's a, a hundred tons of uh, debris came off the hillside and uh, blocked the road five kilometres uh, due south from here. And that's a different spot, isn't it, from where we've had these previous landslips, but you're worried that they were just a little way up the road here, but you're worried there could be another one there as well. It is a different spot, yes. Uh, the, <laughs> we, we are concerned about the, the, the landslide potential just up the road from us, and the rest can be thankful. And what is going on now? What work is taking place now? The clear-up operation on the original landslide is well underway. Uh, our geotechnical experts are currently looking at the, the situation, not, at, not only at the landslide that happened, but also on the rest and be thankful the hill just behind us. It's uh, terribly difficult for people in this area, isn't it? I mean, you've no doubt heard their complaints more than anyone else over the years, but they, it is frustrating for them that they can't use this vital road. No, I mean, uh, we share their frustration. We know how vital the road is for them. We know it's a, it's a major link for Argyll and Butte, and we are making all, every effort to, uh, to, to get the road open again. But safety has to be the main concern. And if the geotechnical experts say that the, road is, that the hillside is still unstable, uh, then, then we have to take their advice on that. Yeah, sure. And in terms of the weather, I mean, it really was a, a ferocious rainstorm that went on for two or three hours this morning, wasn't it, that, that seems to have led to this problem? Yeah, it was 27 millimetres of rain that fell. And, uh, yeah, I mean, we, we had guys on site sort of half an hour after it happened and uh, we were in control of the situation then. And, uh, and finally, the concern is, of course, that there's going to be more rain this afternoon and yet you, you obviously want to get this work done, so it must be a balance but between the two. We want, we want to open the road. That is, that's our main objective. But we can't do it at any cost. We, we have to consider what, what the potential for landslips and, uh, as I said before, it's the, the experts on the hillside that will tell us what the situation is. So there. can you answer the, the $64,000 question, when will it reopen? Uh, we want to get it open as quickly as possible, but, again, safety is the message that we have to, have to, to keep reiterating. And, uh, yes, we're doing everything we can to open the road, but it will be when it's safe to do that. Understood. Thank you very much indeed. Kevin Campbell from Bear Scotland there. And that is obviously the message. They're working as hard as they can. They've begun that work to clear the rubble off the road. But it's going to be very difficult and challenging as, we, as it begins to rain heavily as we expect this afternoon.